All right, guys, today I'm going to help you guys just in case anyone has any questions or maybe just like me, just bought the machine, not 100% sure where everything's at, what size socket you need, so on and so forth. I'm just going to give you guys a quick showdown on how to change the oil. This is a 2019 Kawasaki Brute Force. Um, for instance, this is some of the stuff you're going to need, a 17 millimeter socket for the drain plug funnel to fill your oil oil filter wrench i like to use works the best this is a kawasaki oil filter there's the part number in case you need guys need it uh completely empty it does take 2.11 quarts um right now i'm just running the kawasaki performance 10w40 in it that's what they gave it to me at the dealership for my first oil change so um that's probably what i'm going to continue to run so uh, just like I said, going to help a couple people out in case they have any questions. If you don't have any questions and you've done it a million times, great. Underneath here, I do still have my plow bracket on, so it's hard to uh, maybe a little different than your machine. Um, but underneath that, right there, you can see the drain plug. That is a 17 millimeter. Short extension, 3 eighths is more than efficient to pull that off. So that's that. I did already drain all the oil out of the machine. Took the oil filter off, drained everything out. So I'm actually ready to fill things back up. Um, so back up here again. Uh, obviously, that's where you fill your oil in at. Um, your oil filter is right down... There, if you guys can see that. I'm not sure if there's any other better of a way. Uh, it's on the front of the engine, pretty easy to get to. Um, I do have a garage and stuff. It's just nice outside, so I decided to do it out in the driveway. Um, so like I said, everything's already been drained. I'm gonna put my filter back on, put a little bit of oil in my filter, put some oil on the O-ring, um, and then uh, put my 2.11 quarts right down in there with my funnel so if you guys uh have any questions ask away if not i hope it's at least helpful for the maybe the new owners out there thanks guys